She came from a puppy mill, kept outside her whole life. She was pregnant with a litter of puppies. She had chain burns around her neck from being tied up. She would just go down to the ground. She didn't know how to do anything. She couldn't walk upstairs. With all the other kids, she would play with them and, and want to be near them. She would try to jump up on my lap when I was nursing him. Just constantly trying to be on top of him all the time. He was very calm, barely ever cried. He was very laid back. I think that that was something that she really responded to and really liked. So from the get-go, we saw that there was something very special between them. She really guards him against any kind of trouble. They asked us if we wanted her, and we we're like, oh, I don't know, another new dog right after a brand new baby. Of course, absolutely. They were just running around and sort of dancing and playing, and then they just fell asleep on each other, like the first day. It was beautiful. We have a playroom upstairs, and at one point we vowed that animals would never be allowed in right up there with him all the time, just sitting right beside him as he's doing whatever he's doing. Every morning we walk all the kids and the dogs to school together as a family. One of my son's friends came up and they were petting the dogs. And my son boastfully said, yeah, be rescued. We take all the animals that nobody else wants. And my husband and I just looked at each other like, message was getting through the other side and he was so proud of that. Every one of our animals are rescue animals. They're fantastic, loving, incredible, kind, don't need to be discarded. They're worth giving another another chance for sure. If you can love animals and respect animals that way, hopefully that's sort of your your view for humanity as well.